Do bludgeoning again. Okay, I want to hero point that. <laughs> All right. Uh, That's a 10. 17. Yeah. yeah, miss. It's miss. All right. Pew. Anything else you want to do? You got one action left. Uh, no. I don't think there's much else. Um, yeah, there's not much else I can do. Okay. Uh, Silvana. Everyone's still alive mm -hmm. for now. So I'm going to maybe just try and cast needle darts on this thing. Okay. Now you could also take an action to do like a recall knowledge on something. Um, if you've got like a skill that you think it would be appropriate to identify if it has any weaknesses or what specific resistances it might have, et cetera. So just FYI. Would crafting maybe? I would say yes, since it's clockwork. We'll try that. Yeah. Mm. Nothing's coming to mind. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I'm going to go ahead and just try and cast this. Okay, I'm targeting it. Tis a hit. And that is a hit. That's some damage. It's not for a whopping four damage. And after damage resistance, one. Great. Ah, ah, ah. Better <laughs> than the zero, man. All right. Uh, that's all your actions, Amshara. Uh, I'm going to use my first action to move up. Okay. So step. Or are you going to move up right next to it? Move up right next to it. Because you could go here and still be able to hit it. But okay. Yeah, that's fine too. Uh, no, I, I'd like to be in its base. And, okay. Uh, Fair enough. If it hits, I'm the closest thing for it to hit. Um, second action is to hit. That is a hit. All right. And you presumably it's still up. Yep, still up. Yeah. So I'm gonna hit it again. Nice. Well, let's see. <laughs> it's two I've hits. been rolling four shit on damage. True, but you have a plus eight damage bonus at level two. I guess. So that's <laughs> pretty fucking. You've been doing the most damage to anyone by far. <laughs> Yeah. Only today, yeah. uh, Metal, something is going on. Like the, Dan and I have to talk. The this elemental doesn't rage make barbarian any sense. Are, gotta trade uh, back. Incredibly nasty with their damage output. Uh, very, very, very. When quick. they roll well. <laughs> when you hit, you hit. When you um, hit, that's uh, so, my turn. All right. Yeah, because you moved and swung yeah. twice. You got it. You know, as Chuck would like to say, uh, bloodied. Although in this case it's buried. Mm. Uh, yeah, Volo, you are clumsy one, which basically means uh, you take a. So that's a minus one to all dexterity based checks and DCs, including AC, reflex saves, range attack rolls, and skills using acrobatics, stealth, thievery. So you're a little tipsy. Eh, that's fine. Error brain well, club. Well, now that I've had my uh, free sample here, time for another <laughs> flurry of blows. Very fair. Yep. Two. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, then I'll, uh, for my third attack, I'll go for a flashing spark attack. Ooh. And I'll miss. Okay. All right. Or wait, no. That, you still have one more a flurry action. of blows. Yeah. I'll go for another flashing spark attack. Why not? That's why not. <laughs> All right. All right. Agnar, back to you. Uh, you got to reload. Unless you're going to close into melee. Got to reload. Okay. And then you may commence the firing. Your plug zone. 
<laughs> Oof. Can I hero point that one? Sure. My rolls are off today. How dare you? Oh, no, I'm out of ammo. No, no. Uh, yeah. I don't think I... Actually, no. I did prepare some, but since we went right from this into this, I didn't prepare any because we did yeah. that last larger fight, so... Um, I guess I'm... I suppose you could just add one ammo to your pool because it's a hero point spend anyway, so... Yeah. I could do that. I also have whip it uh, equipped right now. You have a what equipped? A whippet? Uh, yeah, I have, I have whippets. A, a dog. Yeah, I have whippets equipped. He's just got a bunch of <laughs> scrawny Holds race out dogs. A can of cane. <laughs> no, I, I do have a whip uh, equipped yeah. right now, so I might try to attack with that. All right, you'll have to move up to uh, to whip it. Whip it real good. Let's see. Go ahead and add a hero point back. There we go. Dun, 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 dun. You you uh, you know you've pulled a reverse Indiana Jones. You went click and then you pulled out your whip instead of, you know, the guy comes at you with a sword, <laughs> yeah, pistol and shoot him. I don't have the flu, so we can. Uh... Oh, <laughs> fair. That's fair. You can fight with melee weapons today. There you go. All right, so that's Abyss, and uh, yeah, that would be all of it. Joe, that was a reference to an Indiana Jones movie. Which one? Uh, the first one. Yeah. yeah. It's the, first one. the one without yeah, apparently. Shia I've seen Lombard. the Crystal Skull. I'm sorry. I'm not surprised. Uh, <laughs> Joe, uh, or, I'm sorry, Dub Dub, it's your turn. All right, uh, I'm not, and it's just the one... Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna yet. I'm still not getting close to it. Telekinetic projectile. Now, one thing I'll point out, Chuck. Yeah. Is that you could take one action to because there's enough cover and there's because there's like a bar there. You could do that, you could try to stealth and then telekinetic projectile, but I would give you your sneak attack on that. Sure. I will hide behind Ognar. And the bar. Because, I mean, you're bar. just at the end of the bar, so. Uh, so 23 that, for hiding. Uh, uh, definitely does beat its perception DC. So, yep, you're hidden from it. So, yeah. I don't know if the damage will give you an option to choose it, but otherwise we can just roll it manual and add it in. I think it's only okay. D6 right now, so. It's a 20 to hit. So it definitely hits. And then. Actually, it just hits. Ooh. Base damage is a five. Okay. And then my sneak is another four. So nine damage. Nine damage altogether. All right. So let me. And I kill it. No, no. Oh. Uh, I'm just doing math in my head. Okay. Oh. All right. Uh, but that was good. That was good. I did it. You did. Uh, it's still up, but it took damage. Okay. Uh, all right. Yeah, because it's not immune to precision. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, huh? I'm Shara. You're there. You look like you could use a drink. It's already served Bolo his free sample. Uh, so it's going to try to strike you with a leg. Uh, which will hit. For 13 damage. Oh, doke. And then, what is your fortitude bonus? 
plus seven. Plus seven, so 17. So it grabs you, and then it gives you the old bottoms up. Uh, so you also get a free sample of Smoke Side Sour. Uh, click that Fortitude save. Ooh. Okay. So you are clumsy one. It's it's strong <laughs> stuff, man. I don't even like sours. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all of its turn. Uh, and that brings us to Etka. All right. Um, still the one. Can I try to convince them to feed me instead? Um, sure. I mean, you could, you'd have to move. Well, yeah, you could probably try to call it over. Uh, give me a diplomacy. I can move here and then okay. do that. Yeah. Actually, I can just move like right there. Yeah, you can move right there. Yep. Yeah. And yeah, I'll do diplomacy. Okay. Uh, I don't have diplomacy. Okay. Well, we'll see how that turns out on next turn. Uh, you do have an action left. I do. Um, I can use my last hero point on that. Actually, you could do that too. Oof. Uh, uh, well, it, it makes it a 12. A 12 plus 1 is yeah. a 13. It's still not a success, but better than the 7. It is better than a 7. <laughs> um, Can I try again with my other action? Yes, but it will be at, uh, uh, at like a minus 5. Okay. Might as well. You got a 3. I did. I got a negative 2. Nice. Damn. Okay. That's my turn. All right. Uh, Silvana. Uh, first things first is I'm going to try and do another crafting check on this thing. Sure. To maybe possibly a 19. A 19 is pretty darn good. Um, not quite enough, though. I'm a little offended by that. Uh, um, well, <laughs> there goes my idea. I would like to, I mean, I guess I'll try and take my halberd out. Okay. How? Don't think about it. Okay. <laughs> Don't think about it. Strawberry with the halberd. <laughs> like, is it is it a strawberry-sized halberd? Are you I'm tiny or small? I think I'm just small. Was like yeah. gnome size. It's, it's like you know, she's like two foot, two foot six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's fine. I'm small. So she and Dub Dub are like the same height. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, you know, Dub Dub and then Shara are the same height. So. I mean, you just got to saw off the longer part a little Shara bit. That's all. She's like a third height. strawberry head. So I'm just imagining yeah. it's just like a like a, one of those like timpani drum sticks with the head cut off. <laughs> <laughs> and a fucking butcher knife taped to the end. I can't decide between it being like one of the little plastic like sword toothpick type <laughs> oh, things. Amazing. There you oh, go. That's so great. Weird. Or if it's like, you know, Tom and Jerry, like it's just really quick and she pulls out a full size halberd that yeah. just materializes yeah. for a yeah. second. Yeah, pretty like much that. My I favorite, like, that one. <laughs> like movie drops. <laughs> I don't right. think oh, I have enough actions weapons that have no to business swing this to round, but you can move up. Yeah, I'm gonna. Or you can move up, up next to Bolo and then move in next round. No, it's okay. Already, and then move already. back. I already dug my grave. It's fine. Okay. I'm a strawberry. It can't drown me. True. Uh. Uh, that brings us to Mshara. Uh, fuck this thing. Yeah. Uh, you tried to target yourself. Uh, oh, great. That's exactly what I wanted. Uh, 
Uh, here, I, I think I fixed it for you. Would I have missed that? Uh, you know what? Just re-roll. <laughs> okay. Okay. Should be. Okay. I definitely missed that. Uh, yeah. Can I uh, hear a point and try Absolutely. Again? Uh, but let's see what you actually rolled. That was a four, so that's a 14 plus eight. That's a 22. That is a hit. Oh, sweet. So uh, hit your damage. All right. Um, no, that's just your first swing. You get oh. two more if you want. Yeah. Uh, um, that says... <laughs> the, see, this is more like it, guys. <laughs> there we are, back. We're getting back into the group. Getting yeah, back yeah. into it. <laughs> All right. That's uh, my turn. All right, Bolo. All right. Uh, let's see. Flashing spark is part of a flurry of blows. Attack number one. Okay. And attack number two. Yep. Then I'll make a third attack. Technically, oh. you can make a fourth attack. Yes, I can. And I will. Yeah. Or I won't. <laughs> okay. It's hard. Like, I'm seeing three of them right now. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's true. Now, with Flashing Spark, does that let you do fire damage instead? Yeah, if I get a critical with it, I can do a oh. 1d6 recurring fire damage. Nice. Okay. Yeah, you're just like, ah! <laughs> Flailing. I love it. All right. Uh, entering round five, Ognar. <laughs> I'm tr going to try to actually hit this thing like more than once. <laughs> uh, oh, God, I forgot I'm out of ammo. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Um... And it looks like currently you might be targeting yourself right now. I think I am. I was trying to move my character a second ago. Oh, okay, that's fair. I think I'm just going to go back to the whip, see if I can get some kind of damage on it. Sure. Hey, there we go. You hit it with the whip, roll some damage, see what happens. Huh. For bit. some reason, it, it it's like Ognar can just, you know, damage things. I don't know why. Well, that's it. Ognar takes five damage. <laughs> yeah, it oh, does. yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Oh, that's because I'm on your token. Here, let me let me undo that. Let me click this and Oops. let me do that. It was an There we accident. go. Oh, okay. 